Welcome to Amazon QuickSight and the Learning Dashboard. We've built this dashboard as a launch pad to data-driven insights. And this isn't the only way to learn, but a great starting point, filled with on-demand resources curated for you by our experts. Let's begin by looking at the Welcome page, one of several tabs that invite you to explore getting started videos, in-depth workshops that you can finish at your own pace, or persona-based learning paths that give you everything you might need to level up your skills based on which type of user you might be and how you interact with QuickSight. Looking for lessons that meet your busy schedule? You can use this dashboard to filter them by duration and how much time they take. At any time, if you'd prefer learning with others, you can jump to our QuickSight community and see what other users are asking, answering, and learning about together. When we go to the Getting Started page, you'll see three major sections here that allow you to first, acquire new knowledge from a video or self-paced workshop. Second, to analyze, explore, and apply your knowledge by interacting and playing with our examples in Demo Central, or playing with code snippets and embedding in our developer portal. Or three, at any time, you can jump into searching for answers or asking questions in the QuickSight community. On our Learning Resources page, here we can search and drill down on linked content to fit your exact needs by persona, level, content, topic, or delivery method, filtering just to what you need to curate your own learning experience from hundreds of resources. In the admin, developer, reader, and author pages, you can discover and view content that progresses through specific user personas and learning paths based on each identity. Let's look at the developer page. As a developer, I see that this is where I'll go when I want to learn about QuickSight APIs and SDKs, view demos for my use cases, and read technical guides to help me on my journey. All the content on the page is catered to my specific persona, providing me all the resources I need to be successful in my role. When we go to the sample dashboard, we can see QuickSight in action using a given data set focused on SaaS sales data. This is also data that is available to you in the author workshop and what you're looking at here may be an example of what your screen would look like when you're finished with that workshop. Here you can interact with the visuals and uncover insights by hovering over a selected area, giving you inspiration for your own dashboard. For example, if I hover and zoom in on the geo map, I can see that in the United States, there were $457,687 in sales, or if I go to the line chart, I can mouse over the data points and even see a forecast and more information behind the data with tooltips built for me by the author. No matter where you are in your QuickSight learning journey, we hope the QuickSight learning dashboard helps to inspire new insights and exploration. Thanks for watching and feel free to share more of your questions, answers, and expertise with us and with others in the QuickSight community.